me a room here at the Four Seasons Ritz Hotel. Geet and I have arrived yesterday on Valentine's Day as part of our travel plans for 2017. And given that it's our first Valentine's Day as a married couple, we wanted to start it off with a real touch of romance and class, which is why we're here at the Four Seasons. I want to show you guys around the room, what you can expect from it, and why you should come here to spend a romantic getaway in the beautiful city of Lisbon. So, without any further ado, let's get straight into the room tour. As soon as you enter the premier room here at the Four Seasons, you're greeted by this beautifully detailed tapestry on the walls, which adds this very warm and elegant feel. Then, to your left, you have the bathroom, which we'll go into in a second. Further up, you have the mini bar section, with snacks, drinks, and all the stuff you'd normally expect. There's even an espresso machine. For now though, let's jump right back into the bathroom and I'll show you guys around in there. So, we're now in the bathroom here in the premier room, and as you can tell, it's all marbled out, which looks really, really nice. To your immediate left, you have a shower cubicle, and that has a rainfall shower head, and as well as a dedicated hose, so you can choose between the two which one you want to use. There's also a small shelf where you can place your toiletries. Come forward to your left, and there's a separate room with the bidet and the toilet in there, giving you that extra bit of privacy when you need to go. Behind me, there's even a large and spacious bathtub, which is perfect for those relaxing nights in after a long day exploring the city. To your right, you then have a really large, well-lit mirror, as well as two his and her sinks, so that you don't have to argue over who gets the sink in the morning. So, that's it for the bathroom. Let's go straight into the master bedroom and I'll show you around in there. Okay, so we've made it to the master bedroom of the premier room. What you immediately notice as you walk in is just how spacious this thing is. It's not cluttered at all. There's a very minimal amount of furniture and decor, and I love it. It looks really simple and elegant. To your right, you have a two-seater sofa with a coffee table. In the far right of the room, there's a lovely wooden desk, perfect for getting some work done. And in the center of the room, there's a large smart TV, which can be pivoted to angle anywhere in the room. So whether you're on the sofa or on the bed, you can enjoy the late night TV. As you come into the center of the bedroom, you're immediately drawn to this really large queen-sized bed. It's really comfortable to sleep on. Me and Geet had an incredible night's sleep yesterday. Everything from the bed linen to the mattress is incredibly soft and comfortable. And along either side, there are two bedside tables with lovely large lamps there too. On the far left of the room, you then got inbuilt storage with plenty of it. <laughs> we were able to fit all of our suitcases and bags with no problem and with plenty of room to spare. So right now we're on the balcony of the premier room here at the Four Seasons Ritz and it's just breathtaking. <laughs> Honestly, it's breathtaking. You get such an amazing view of Lisbon out here. You've got Marquish Bombal roundabout right here, which is one of the focal points of the city, to be honest, uh, followed by the park right here in front of us, a long stretch of greenery all the way up to the monument at the top. And of course, you've got St. George's Castle right in the backdrop over there on top of the hill, another big monument you need to visit. And this all ties in so well to the whole romantic getaway feel uh, of being at the Four Seasons Ritz. You know, you're on the 10th floor right up here in a lovely room. You walk outside onto the balcony to have a drink or your breakfast in the morning like we did. And look at this kind of, look at the view you get. It's amazing, really. Take a further look behind me and you've got the River Dejou. So, you know, with this kind of panoramic view, it just kind of tops off that feel of being somewhere luxurious and that kind of classy vibe. It feels amazing, honestly. What do you think? <laughs> Did you like the room tour? What about this view? Would you come in for this? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Everyone helps. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.